Good morning, guys. Uh, this is probably a continuation of the last video. So, uh, I guess not welcome back, but this is the next morning. And those turkeys that we heard yesterday down in this bottom, we're going to hike down to where we were at the end of the day. So, I think if we're down there right around, you know, 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock, we're going to get some birds in. So, um, yeah, we're going to get down in there. Uh, I'm bringing the shotgun today because the setup I'm using for my bow just feels, um, it's not quite totally set up right now. And I just, I don't know if I'm not totally confident in it for turkeys. And I just kind of want to kill one on this public land. So we're bringing a shotgun today. I know, I'm listening out. So, uh, yeah, we will catch you guys uh, when something interesting happens or we're down there. And... Let's go get a turkey. Hey guys, that tom is sitting right down in there somewhere. So we're gonna set up on this timber line, see if we can't pull him up here. goes again I don't know if I should get lower he's not that far so I'm gonna get tucked up in here okay let's go get these two clays set out He's coming. Okay. This turkey is right over the hill. And he's he's coming into us. Go ahead with him, crap.
Oh my gosh. <sighs> Holy cow. Oh my gosh. And now it's recording. Holy cow, I'm shaking right now. Oh, oh my gosh. Yes. Public land, turkey down. Oh man. Oh. Oh wow. I can't even speak. It's a big old boss Tom. Oh. Seven inch beard on him. Goodness. Oh. Wow. Oh, look at that, son. First bird ever on public land. Called them in. It's not even eight o'clock yet. I heard them on the roost. They got down off the roost. I gave him a couple of hen yelps, had the decoys set up. He came he came flying in strutting. Wow. Oh man. Okay guys, well uh I gotta go ahead and get this guy tagged. But look at that bird. Beautiful colors on him. What a gorgeous, gorgeous bird. Let's flip him over. Really quick, I just wanted to point out, I shot that bird and uh, also called them my brother's bird. There were two Blymart decoys and these were, this one cost me $14. And um, this one cost me eight. So you don't need to go buy Dave Smith decoys to kill birds. Um, and you don't even need decoys. Uh, I've called in lots of birds to range without decoys, but they do help in certain situations and these ones are super light and I can throw them in my pack. I don't got to worry about them breaking because I can just buy new ones, but yeah, I'm hooked on the phone, man. Because it gets big birds like that. Good three-year-old bird. So anyways, I'm going to figure out a way to get him packed up and out of here. Got a three-mile hike out of here. That's why this bird's still alive is because he's so far back here. <laughs> uh yeah just look at that morning gotta love it thank you god for another success man hey guys before i took off i figured i'd show you i cut off some extra uh straps that were on my um vest here just like the last few straps, I tied him to a stick, spread his legs, and I just throw it over my shoulder like that. Man, it's working nifty. It's way easier than trying to carry him out here with my hand, so. Work smarter, not harder than that one for my Uncle Pete. Uh, yeah, well, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed today's episode, because I sure did. And...